I want to show you this delicious breakfast that I made. It's so good. It's um, corned beef hash and bacon, turkey bacon, and green onions and garlic. And then I also put Italian seasonings in them. And then I made fried potatoes with a baked potato. Also put Italian seasoning on it. Ah, oh, it's delicious. This is what I make almost every breakfast. Like, look at this. It's a lot of food. It's like two bucks to make for a sack of potatoes is three dollars. Corn beef and hash is a buck fifty. Eggs are like five bucks for five dozen. Green onions are fifty cents. Turkey bacon's like two or three or nine. And then you know, the amount of meals you can make from those uh, ingredients is amazing. And that's how I eat good food and save a lot of money. It's also the only meal I eat like once a day. It's so big I'll eat it and then go to bed and then hibernate on it for like the next five or six hours. And then be good until probably about like four in the morning or so when I'm at work. So we're 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. And after I get off at work at 7 a.m., I usually stay up until maybe, depending on how tired I am, between 11, 11 a.m. and maybe 12.30 p.m. So I stay up until then. And then... Then I get up around 5.40 p.m. Excuse my alarm for 20 minutes. And then wake up at 6. Then I take a shower. And get ready to work. And I still got all that food in my tummy, so I'm still good to go. Don't eat breakfast. Go on MySpace a little bit, or Facebook. And then... Comb my hair, look at myself in the mirror. And then I'll listen to a power song, like now. Let's go on YouTube. Since I'm the only one home during the time I'm getting ready for work, I should be like, go on YouTube. And then play this song. It's called Love Sick Part 2.
normal things pretty normal so that's my morning power up jam before I go to work But yeah, so it's now 10.30 a.m. Now I've been up for probably about I think about almost 20 hours now. I was up late yesterday because of Christmas stuff. I don't work until 11 p.m. tonight. So I can stay up and try and fight it as best I can. It's a lot of food and I'm just down. It's so good. So. For Christmas presents. Ideas. I will share with everybody. My coworker Sean had made a glove. And he tied the glove, and he made like this little figurine like this. And I'm like, oh, that would be sweet to make into a paper mache doll. And 
I decided to do such this. So this is Sean's first design. This is for him. This is just the first one that I got made. I'm gonna make a bunch more like this. And then I'm gonna add another layer of paper mache and make it thicker. I was thinking something about plaster, but I don't know. That was, that was a good suggestion about plaster, but I don't know anything about plaster. And then I'm gonna put a white primer on there, sand it down, make it all smooth, and then add a nice glossy finish. And then uh, paint on designs or something like that and put like I was thinking either big googly eyes like you know something like that or like these tiny little eyes I don't know but people are excited this because I'm it's gonna be fun to make this was another little kind of a creature design I made as well it's like a big monster I could also imagine like tiny little eyes on his body or something like that, or maybe big eyes. I was thinking also at one point doing like Totoro kind of thing, or like a bunny rabbit. But people also like more like the funky monster design. So this is what else I'm going to be working on. There's so much food. It's getting cold before. I can finish it. Let's see. This is also my good. This is my wake up. This is another wake up song. It's called "The City" by Milosh. Mary seems to have a real need to be stirred up about someone. She spent. had its ups and downs. They all do. But I guess we had worked out pretty good adjustment. Some affections in our sex life. And just decisions in the good of acting I am at doing slow motion. That was all real time.
I think that's going on for 15 minutes. It's kind of weirding me out, so I'm going to stop it. I almost finished my breakfast. Maybe next time, though.